tell me how it's been here doing all the McDonald's All American festivities so far. Oh, it's been great. McDonald's have been doing a great job of just putting together a great event. Uh, everybody's been out here competing and having fun. And you committed to UNC early. Um, a lot of people, a lot of people didn't do that. Why did you choose to do that? Uh, I chose to commit to UNC early because I just felt like it was the best fit, and I didn't want to lead other coaches on and have them keep trying to recruit me if I knew where I wanted to go. Okay. Was UNC like a place you always wanted to go? Was it just the ideal fit? Oh uh, no, nah, not really. I mean, I didn't really know where I wanted to go, but once I got to meet the coaches and just see how they play, I knew it fit, fit me the best. Right. What excites you about North Carolina? Just the way they play. They play fast and they play through the big man, and it's a big man dream. Right, right. About, yeah, that's not that's not really the case anymore in college basketball. Yeah. Obviously, well, basketball period yeah. anymore. But yeah, it is a good, a good opportunity for you. How did that make you feel? Just being able to do that. I mean, it just feels great just knowing I can go in and showcase my skills inside and out. And what uh, stands out to you about this year's team as uh, in, in the tournament? Uh, I would say we're not the most talented team, but I feel like we play the best together, and it's been making all the difference. Um, has there been any trash talk between you and the Duke commits here? Oh, definitely. Um, me and Wendell and Vernon, we've been going at it all the time. The game the other day, they almost lost to UCF. We were all watching it live, and you know, I was pretty excited, but I ended up being hurt because they pulled it out. Where did y'all watch it at? Oh, uh, in the Players' Lounge. Where's, where's that at? At our hotel. Okay. What do you think it's going to be like when y'all face each other next year? Oh, uh, it'll definitely be competitive. I mean, we've been playing against each other since the eighth grade, so we kind of know each other's weaknesses and strengths, but just being able to play at that big of a stage against each other would be huge. And have you been uh, trying to lobby for anybody to come to UNC? Definitely. I mean, I've been out here recruiting Precious, Cole, and Matt Hurd. Those are the three guys that we mainly want at UNC, so I've been going harder. What if you to team up with somebody like Cole who you've been tight with for a minute? I mean, Cole's one of my best friends, so just being able to play with him and we both know how we both know how to play with each other to be great. Right. What do you feel like your role could be on next year's team? You want to see? Uh, I feel like I'm going to make an impact off the rip and just show the world and also UNC fans and everybody how what I can do. Um, what would it mean to go into a program if they can pull it off, pull off the uh, championship? How would how, how would you feel about, about going into a program like that, just coming off a win? I mean, going into a program with such a winning culture, just that's one of my main goals, is try to win a national championship, or at least make it to the Final Four. So that was definitely calculated in me committing. Right. And what in your game are you trying to work on and improve on before you enroll at UNC? Just uh, expanding my game even more. I mean, because I basically got all the inside stuff down packed. So just getting better outside, being able to shoot the ball, and just doing different things like that. What are some of the things that coach that have, uh, have wanted you to improve on it even here and this week? Just like just shooting and defending, just all the regular stuff. For real. Okay, appreciate it. No problem.